come, hey? <laughs> I don't want to make a noise. You know why? <laughs> different studio, different location. What up? This is the brand new episode of The Weekly Show. Which boy, DJ Kartu, Asia. Yeah, game, the nowadays boss. Hey, bookshelves and everything, Baba. Different location, different new things. And new things. This week on The Weekly Show, we're talking about so much. You know, we're talking about so much. So many things happened. Uh, the first story that we're talking about, which is in gossip, RIP Pro Kid. Oh, Pro Kid. You were, yes, Pro Kid, you were great. I used to, that number one Soweto boy who used to look up to you growing up, rapping, even other. You inspired so many people, inspired the culture. RIP Pro Kid. Even uh, AKA and Questa were there at his memorial service you know performing the giving the crowd what they once recorded with pro kid he i want it all from the sky to the ground that's the song they performed oh. <laughs> r.i.p pro you were the best that number one so what a boy you made venek rapping beautiful you know, someone who's not having a beautiful time or who didn't have a beautiful time over the weekend was uh, Floyd Shibambu. Was it over the weekend? Doesn't really matter. EFF De Deputy President Floyd Shibambu was arrested for driving 182 kilometers in an 120, uh, uh, 120 kilometer zone in Winberg in Free State. This guy was driving a Range Rover. So you know, Baba, big cars, Baba. You know everything that is big, Baba. Eh? Even big women. Ah, hey, Women's Month. <laughs> Floyd, drive safely, drive nicely. It's free stay, it's not counting, eh? Eh? At least he didn't try to bribe anyone. He, he got arrested, got out on bail or whatever that it is. It was he, he was charged, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, second, third story. So, something that the cops do, which we do not know about, is give people food, make communities happy. Do you know of that? No, because cops don't do that. Well, not the cops in Tabong, because the cops in Tabong teamed up with uh, Goldfield Rotary Club to give people of, what's what's this township? Tabo, Tabong in Velcom. They gave them 400 five kg bags of mealy meal blankets, and this is in the free state. So clearly the free state, cops do a lot in the free state. They arrest, they donate, they jolla slay queens. They do a lot, okay? Cops do a lot in the free state. Hey, it's not such a free state for people who speed. Hey, Floyd, we see you. <laughs> Someone who also passed away. Hey, man, I repeat to the queen of soul music. Ooh, ooh, mama, ooh, fr ooh, Aretha Franklin. You know, she did the R-E-S-E-P-T. I think I skipped the letter. But respect. Aretha Franklin. Also, Kofi Annan. What a great, phenomenal man. Kofi Annan, R.I.P. to the legend Kofi Annan. Did so much for Africa, to the UN. What a great loss to the world. So R.I.P. Aretha Franklin, R.I.P. Pro Kid, the number one Soweto boy, R.I.P. Kofi Annan. <sighs> There's so much in, 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 in gossip. There's so much, eh? DJ Tira's dancer, uh, okay, well, he was granted bail now. His name is Ntantla Kiliza. Um, better known as Skaka. You know the one that dances, the one with the belly, uh, the one that does the voice. Yes, he was caught. <laughs> Jandil, chop off his penis if he's found guilty. Oh. <laughs> For allegedly trying to rape a 13 year old. Oh, I don't know. It's, I, I don't know if he tried or he was caught in the act. But this guy was, um, is facing charges for raping a 13 year old and he's 33, my man, that's so disgusting. He's busy jumping up and down stages, can't he hear you little shongolo, you can't keep it inside your pants. Sis. Affortainment is about to issue out a statement, so probably by the time you see the weekly show, the statement will be out. Because DJ Tira responded to a fan and said this. Okay, if you can't read, what is written here it says, DJ Tila says, Baba, we do not condone any form of abuse against women, against children, and we will issue out a statement. Hence, I'm saying, if you're watching this, the statement is probably out. If not, they tweet. Okay, we love you. <laughs> Moving on to sports. 
sports, Baba. The first person I need to talk about on sports is my boy Kune, Dumelen Kune, whose girlfriend was in an accident. This guy's been shuttered, man. Every day he's posting, my queen, get better. Uh, things are not going well at Kaiser Chiefs. Kaiser Chiefs is losing. Things are just not going well for this guy. This guy's my guy. So this story, it's really not a story, but it's just me not telling Kunuk to back up so long. Things are going to be fine. God loves you. He loves your girlfriend. She will be fine. Okay? <laughs> she will be fine. We, we are us at the weekly show. We pray for her too. Yes. Story number two. So, Modric, Mo Salah, Ronaldo, Baba. Are you waiting for his picks? Four. The player of the season. How crazy is that? You know what's crazy? It's the fact that UEFA is still using Ronaldo's pictures, which he was still when he was still at. I understand. I understand. They don't want to promote the fact that he's at Juve, Juventus now, but use recent pictures of him on, at Juventus. Don't use pictures when you are still there at uh, Real Madrid because you know he's no longer there. And because he's not there, there's no more El Clasico. I'm kidding, there is. <laughs> it's now called the El Messi. Hey? <laughs> what does Celtics, Stamptowns, Highlands Park, and Chipako, Black Leopards have in common? You don't know? Well, they haven't lost this season yet. Yes, Kaiser Chiefs, Orlando Pirates, Super Sport, IX Cape Town, all these other teams have lost in the Premier Soccer League. And these four teams haven't lost. Well done, well done. Don't lose. If you watch the weekly show and some and there's a game on Wednesday or, not, or Thursday, and one of these teams win. Hey, so three of them haven't lost. Well done, boys. Well done. <laughs> yes. You like my new studio? I like it too. <laughs> Moving on to lifestyle. So I don't know if I should continue laughing. <laughs> Nicki Minaj versus Travis Scott Baba. Nicki Minaj is a very, very, very talented human being, but also she's very funny, you know, because she's blaming Travis Scott's daughter, Stormy, and Kylie Jenner's fame for him selling his records and him beating out the numbers because the first num the first week numbers were out and her numbers were low like really ridiculously low lower than 190 so she's blaming everyone she's trying to blame everyone she even went on to say i wrote a freestyle who writes a freestyle who, who writes a freestyle nikki come down freestyle is supposed to do it there it's in the moment free and flow you are busy writing things here. Are you trying to tell us that you got a ghostwriter? That is insane. <laughs> Kanye West makes it to the second story on lifestyle. Kanye West went to um, Two Chains, Two Chains wedding, dressed in a suit and flip flops. Who does that? The suit is a Louis Vuitton suit. Shout out to Virgil Abloh, we see you off-white guy, hey? <laughs> but why is Kanye wearing flip? Don't you like my sneaks, hey? Sneaks are hot. <laughs> why would you wear like flip-flop to a wedding? We understand like our fashion icon, nonsense. Kanye West, nonsense, with your wife looking like a highlighter. Hi, 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 hi. Out there ruining people's weddings. What is this highlighter and flip-flops? Nonsense people. <laughs> I actually wanted to say, what are those? But you can see what they are. Anyway, gospel star Tina Zungu getting close with his side dish. But this guy doesn't, eh? He doesn't care, but he just wants to eat left and right, left and right. My kwapeni this, my kwapeni this. Hey? This guy's been seen so many times and there's a lot of pictures that are doing the rounds of this guy with this specific lady who is not his wife clearly this guy is in a different light hey busy jollering here singing about god and jesus and how being faithful and god loves us you're busy eating other fruits what is wrong with you he got your eve at home busy eating maria <laughs> Rubbish call spell star. You are a rubbish person. All right. <laughs> Shout out to Heavy K. Wow, wow. Hey, Heavy K. 
<laughs> Heavy K makes it to a fourth story on Lifestyle. <laughs> Heavy K is at the gym. Jimmy. <laughs> Yo, Heavy K. Yeah, you're doing great, my man. I'm, I'm coming too. You're doing great. Shout out to Heavy K. He's at the gym, shooting at the gym. You know what it is. Trying to get the summer body. <laughs> More like 20, 30 body. <laughs> hey, no body shaming. Heavy K. We'll see you in the summer. We love you. In the land, in the way. We see you. <laughs> On to weird news. Look, we all know South Africa. And South Africa has been on Twitter, Facebook. It's on the news. Everyone is talking about Sbatli's uh, Pisa and his car accident. And quite frankly, I pray and hope that she recovers and she goes back to the person that she is. She's such a bubbly, lovely person. Kune's girlfriend, my boy's girlfriend. Hey, by Atandana, they love each other. But what's fascinating is there's a lady who snatched a weave on the day of the accident, at the scene of the accident, while she was there, passed out, this lady went and snatched her weave. Like, morals, my lady. What is kind of tech behavior is this? You witch. What kind of witchcraft is this? Oh, oh, she's in an accident. I'm going to snatch her weave. Satan. That lady. I hope your hands fall off. Anyway. Lillian Dube makes it to a weird story number two. <laughs> the clientele dick. <laughs> Lillian Dube has seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Zola seven. Dildos. Vibrators. Baba. Hey, to tune herself. <laughs> she is 73. <laughs> She says, don't cheat. Find something to pleasure yourself. She's got different sizes, Baba. Hey? <laughs> when I see you now on this clientele life, I now know you have clientele day. Hey, Mama. <laughs> we love Lillian Tube. But these seven vibrators that she's telling women to get, no. Okay. We love you. This has been the weekly show with your boy DJ Katu in Jaya Cape Thursday. I don't know if I don't know when this is going to be out. If it comes out on Friday, last night I was at Kantari, which was on a Thursday. This Saturday, I'm not doing anything. Sunday, I'll be out at uh, Jubilee Park in Kempton Park at a party on the 31st of August, my birthday party at the social club in Maboning. Pe, 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 for bookings. Bookings at djkatu.com. I love you. I'm not wearing Jandini. Stay true to yourself. Get seven dude.